Well, there's nothing quite like this occasion. Welcome to the UEFA Champions League final. The best two teams in Europe this season preparing to go head-to-head -head for the crowd. This is Derek Ray in the commentary position, and I'm joined as always on these big occasions by Stuart Robson. It is Liverpool facing Manchester City. Well, Derek, you just wonder what those players are thinking right now. Some will be nervous, some will be excited, and some may be anxious. But once that whistle blows, we're going to be in for an absolute classic here. This is how Liverpool start the game. Alisson gets the nod in goal. Andrew Robertson starts with Trent Alexander-Arnold in the fullback positions. Mohamed Salah plays with Sadio Mane out wide. And rather than use a strike partnership, they've gone with just the one player in attack. Now. The ball with Rodri. And it's Ruben Diaz. Walker. Well, Mo Salah knows how to light up any game, I think it's fair to say, Stuart. Well, it's his ability with the ball at his feet that makes him such a good player. He can go past defenders with ease, he can play in tight areas, and he has that bit of trickery as well. I'm really looking forward to seeing him play today. Matip. Here is Thiago. Mane. Henderson. Mane! And still an opportunity. Danger averted for now. De Bruyne. The ball with Rodri. Grealish. Grealish, still looking for space, pulls it back, good physical play, oh, good defending to stop a decent looking attack, Fabinho, and this is Diogo Jota now, Jota, here's Salah, Jota, here's Thiago, Fabinho, and it's in, Liverpool up on the scoring in the Champions League final. Just look at this again, the combination play in the top third of the field was so precise. And then what a strike. That's hit with such ferocity. Certainly no stopping that. That's a great goal. On they go again. A wake-up call for the City players, maybe. Can they find a response now? Rodri. And it's Ruben Diaz. Laporte. Ruben Diaz. It's with Laporte. Jesus. The 
just knocking it around looking to carve out a chance Torres using all his defensive acumen to cut it out well Liverpool haven't dominated possession as you can see but when they have won it back in midfield areas their counter-attacking has been excellent they'll be happy with the way the game's going at the moment Henderson and Mohamed Salah now cuts it back Henderson. Here's Fabinho. And Thiago. That's all they can conjure for now. Rodri. And getting close to half time with Liverpool in front here. Stuart, what strikes you about what you've seen from them in the first half? Well, I think they've been the better side in this first half. They've defended well, they've looked dangerous in attack and they've controlled the midfield. It's been a solid performance so far. A good and fair challenge. Diogo Jota. Thiago. This is Salah. He's given it away. And with that, the first half draws to a close. <laughs> 45 minutes separating these two sides from glory. The second half of the Champions League final begins. Salah. On to Silva. And Manchester City moving the ball with purpose. And a strong tackle. Gabriel Jesus and return to De Bruyne and it's Gabriel Jesus it's a neat move De Bruyne Bernardo Silva and it's still on for him and let's give credit to the defending Diogo Jota And back with Thiago. Jota. And now Henderson. Mane. Pivotal moment defensively. Rodri. 30 minutes to go then. Torres. On to Jesus. Grealish. Well, the ball can be the goalkeeper's best friend and no nonsense defensive clearance well they're so unlucky not to be level now it was a great effort you just wonder if they're going to regret that this is Thiago intercepting it intelligently Racing forward, trying to catch them out. Gabriel Jesus. And they're moving the ball neatly enough. Just looking for that decisive pass. Just 20 minutes remaining now. He's given the ball away here, Salah. Well, as the stats confirm, City have controlled the ball, but they've shown a real lack of invention today. One or two of their more talented players need to step up now to get them back into this game. Good movement. And good pressure high up the pitch. Bernardo Silva. Well, a classic example of how to intercept. Andrew Robertson. Well, almost at full-time, Liverpool desperate to make this a victory. Stuart, your thoughts? 
Well, it's going to be a nervy end to this game. But if they do hold on, I think they've deserved their win. They've played really well and they've played some good attacking football. And in general, they've controlled the game. Andrew Robertson. Van Dijk with it. Henderson. There might very well be late excitement. Five minutes left and the margin just one. Andrew Robertson. Sadio Mane now. Physically strong and secure on the ball. Well, nicely cut out. Can they fashion something? They need a goal. And credit is due for that good piece of defending. How about this? England's most successful European club have done it again. Liverpool, the winners of the Champions League. Well, just look at the emotions out there. Joy and relief on one side, despair and heartache on the other. But we've got the right winners here. They fully deserved it on the night. For these players, well, it's the night of their lives. And they're determined to enjoy every millisecond. Well, they have to make the most of this, don't they? It's a great feat. What an achievement from them. Well, they don't need to be reminded about what comes next. It's the presentation of the coveted Champions League trophy. Well, there's some tired players out there, but what you can be sure of, they'll find some energy when they get their hands on the trophy. They'll be going mad in the next few moments. The kings of European club football, Liverpool. Well, this is what they wanted. What a moment for these players. They've worked so hard to win this trophy. They've been fantastic. And you can feel the emotion. It's natural to reflect on this final, but so much hard work has gone into the entire campaign. Memories, memories. What would a celebration be without the chance to enjoy it with your own supporters? Well, these fans have certainly played their part, haven't they? They'll savour these moments. They've travelled far and wide to follow their team. They're loving every minute of this, and why not? They deserve it. A performance of fire as well as ice. They held their nerve when that was necessary. And these celebrations will run long into the night. Well, these are the moments they have to make the most of. It doesn't happen very often, does it? These will be photos to cherish for years to come. Brilliant stuff. And you are looking at the best club side in Europe.